Hi, my beautiful friends. I hope that you're doing so, so well today. So for today's heatless scrunchy curls, you're going to need a comb and some mousse. I'm just using this SGX NYC stuff and some scrunchies and a water bottle or you can have your hair wet from either a shower or bath. So I'm just starting out by combing through my hair to make sure there's no tangles and it just makes the process a lot easier instead of them getting all caught up in the scrunchies. And then I think the curls come out a little bit smoother. After that, I'm going to wet my hair and this is actually like day one like cleaned hair. So you can do this on day two or three, it doesn't really matter. And I think the curls stay better if it is on more like dirtier hair. Once the hair is wetted, I went ahead and just take my mousse and you can also use oil or hairspray, whatever just works best for you or what you have on hand. And I just spread that through around like the root area all the way down to the ends of my hair. After you got that mixed in, take your first scrunchie and all you have to do is wrap it around the middle part of the scrunchie and just roll it on up kind of like you would a sleeping bag or whatever. <laughs> and once you get to either your roots or however far you want the curls to start slash like land, you're going to see that there is the two parts of the scrunchie left over and you're going to take the one side and tuck it in to the hole that is still left over and it creates its own like little seal. Watching it more than hearing me describe it is a little bit easier to follow but once you have that done then you just do that all throughout your head and you can change the ways that your curls land. So I'm back and they're all completed. I used all the scrunchies that I have and if you have any like loose ones you can just pin them and make sure they stay. And just for added measure I sprayed my hair a little bit more just to help with the curls forming especially if I had drier pieces of hair. And I'm gonna go ahead and sleep on it and show you what they look like in the morning. So welcome back. They're all glamorous and slept on and they actually all stayed throughout the night which is awesome. I'm going to go ahead and start taking them out. So all you need to do is just untuck the elastic that you tucked into the other side and unroll them and voila! So I'm going to go ahead and unravel the rest of them and here they are. So what's kind of cool is each of them come out a little bit different and I like this because they're really boingy and super cute. So I just brush them out and I think they look kind of like old Hollywood. They're really cute and super fun and fluffy and that's how they look. They come out different a little bit every time. So yeah, definitely try them out and let me know what you think. Bye!